What's up guys, Apex Mint Gamer 2020 here, coming at you with another Project Wingman video. And in today's video, we're going to be moving on with our campaign here, and I think we're in mission number 11. Uh, these missions are going to get continuously harder, but let's dive into this and blow some shit up. Pilots, listen up. I'm getting in my plane right now. So when this briefing is done, I expect to see all of you running. All Allied air power not currently predisposed in other operations are to be scrambled immediately and make their way to the Bering Strait. In the days since the destruction of the Solana communication relay, the Federation has been disorganized and subject to our own electronic warfare countermeasures. It is because of this, our first conventional victories up and down the front lines are being reported and the Federation is dealing with losses it hasn't had to deal with in decades. Recently, in order to improve individual unit combat effectiveness, the Federation has been discharging Cascadian manned units and replaced them with soldiers who aren't nationals. Subsequently, many of our once misguided countrymen have defected and are providing us with invaluable intel and manpower. Earlier today, one of our patrols caught a group of transports using the cover of an Arctic storm to get unorganized and underpowered Federation units out of Cascadia probably to regroup and redeploy later. The patrol engaged, and the Federation sent more fighters to cover them. Seeing as these transports represent the bulk of Federation forces who have experienced fighting us, we did not want them to regroup, so we sent more reinforcements. Squadron leaders and base commanders on both their side and ours have been escalating force deployment ever since combat began. High-profile squadrons and our forces in theirs are currently present. The snowball effect, however, has been inadvertently created by all accounts what is turning out to be the most expansive aerial battle in the war thus far, and is steadily falling out of control. We cannot let the Federation have any more of their forces escape and regroup, even if it means the largest furball in history. Alright, let's go to war. Select our planes and our weaponry. Start mission. All right, how much money do we have? We have forty-six thousand. Um, so we have an F-15 option. This looks like it's going to be primarily air-to-air. -air. That's K-27. That's actually a Russian plane. That's sixty-two grand, though. So we'd have to sell a jet. Oh, we have the Harrier. They call it a Sisipit or whatever the hell, however the hell you pronounce that, but this is actually an APAP Harrier, and I believe that's mostly yeah, anti ground. Uh, slot 1 and 2 here have air to air capabilities. This thing, do I still own that? No, I don't own that, thank God. Anything that's green, I don't own. That was a good one. We'll keep that. So I really only own three planes. I own that one, the F-14, which they all have air-to-air -air capabilities in three separate slots. So that is an option. This will give us a little bit of air to ground or anti-ground. Oh, let's see what we can arm here. Multi-lock anti-air anti-air missiles, semi-active air missiles. And it makes us select air to ground as well. Get eight large unguided bombs or forty-eight anti-ground missiles. Yeah, we'll go with that. And we'll, uh, I guess we'll go with this color scheme. Do we get to pick one? Well, this is a pretty cool color scheme anyway. Alright, guys, let's, oh, uh, modules. Yeah, we want the player for sure. I gotta actually figure out how to use those. I, don't, I still don't remember if I uh, figured out how to use those or not. But anyway, let's go ahead and launch this mission. We'll have our standard missiles too. Alright, here we go. Oh, of course, we're 
little less sensitive. It's way more sensitive than uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator, which is a game, a game I just got done playing. I feel so weird after I just played my soft place in the game. And in, and in that game, I was actually rocking the uh, F-18. I'm gonna pop this guy down for the first shot. And miss. Tag him with another missile. Got him. Alright, he's gotta come down. Oh, we didn't even have our guns so I could. Oh, we 
got hit. I don't know what button is to pop my players. What is that one? You gotta keep on the move. to go the water. That pilot's great. He just passed by. behind us.
Nice! Okay, they're saying it. Got him. I'm not even paying attention to how much of what I got. There's so many targets. They've got my rocket. Get around there. We're right on top of it. Stacked up. Oh crap, too far. Ooh, this. Flew right back over us. Dang, what is this? A gauntlet? Oh, yeah, right, he's gone. Think about how many millions of dollars of planes. We're just killing up here. Oh, that's gonna be a long shot. It'll hit. Oh, it hit only hit though. We're actually at time limit, or we just fight till the game ends. Got one hit on him. Got one of them. Monarch, you're 
So many people gunning him down at once. Wow, he's amazing. Holy cow. Watch him fly. Look how many rockets are flying at him. Somebody's gonna get him eventually. And we finally got him. Wow. Now that was an intense fire fight. Oh, there's more? Oh, yep, yeah, over here. It's gotta be the last two chance for their bugging out. the storm. There they go. Good separation. Damn. Nice one. Jump, jump. Maybe we can hit two rockets here. Oh, that's gonna be it. We have left of standard missiles. Looks like it's those mercenaries. Think they might turn tail and run again? Not this time. Open fire. Alright, we got at least 12. Federation. Oh. Bring them on. Let's do this. We got at least 12 of uh, the green pilots. Green planes and, uh,. Looks like just six priorities. Take him down, boys. Yeah, of course they're going to be stupid and impossible to take down. They will not dodge me forever. Well. Come on, man. Holy cow. Come on, get him, get him, get him. What do you mean the only hit? He took two rockets. Not letting up on him until he goes down. That's four times this dude got hit. Got it. All right, there's one down. X-23 Crimson. Oh great, I'm out of all my special weapons. Oh, we hit him, we hit him. 
Going down, Crimson. You're in my bullseye now. Clean dodging this. Where'd he go? Come on, come on. Oh, look how he's doing it. That's just not even fair, man. Down you go. Crimson's down. Oh, apparently they're all crimson. So you don't actually get the pilot's call sign or name. They just got a really good throw. Oh, we almost re-rendered him. He's got a tough to take down, but bring it on, man. I can't rely on any of uh, my AI pilots to actually hit these guys. Boom! Another one bites the dust. I do want to get these uh, other green planes. These not an important priority planes down. We're not on a time schedule. So we can take our time to knock these guys out too. Damn, how close I gotta get? There we go. Boom. There goes another one. Holy cow, they have a crap ton of the green guys around here. I call them green guys, but that's the color of the right guy, whatever. Everybody's dying today. We got three, five more of the priorities to take out. This is tough, I will say that. Oh, this one's a little close enough for guns we can spin around on it. That works too. Pop our flares, which I finally figured out how to do. Take down all the little minions. We'll just have the big guys to worry about. Maybe our fighters can help me out a little bit. I'm trying to keep an eye on my altitude, but the screen is so shaky. Oh my god. One of those hit. Hoping now that all the uh, other jets are down. My guys can hit help keep the pressure on them. I'd also like to get them up here and fight them. Get all the freaking missile trails. Alright, 
Ethan, that's one to die. Whoa, what the hell are you doing? Oh, I should have kept firing the guns. I had a good streak of gun work on it. Alright, let's go down another one. was a heck of a mission. That the full fury of Federation air power was unleashed today over the Bering Strait. And miraculously, thanks to the actions of the Hitman team, we have not only survived it, but bested it. The Federation's force projection capabilities will be heavily decreased now that their air support across the theater has been effectively decimated. I didn't want to click that. But anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this mission. I do hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Hit Peace man, out. Man.